how did you come up with the song even if you call so even if you call came to me actually in church so i played in church sunday and i was there you know when the when the pastor's preaching he like like some some music in the background and Kind of like a melody came to me, like. And then da 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 da. So that that was kind of how even if you call came to me. Yeah, when when yeah. Eric came to me to say, okay, Alex, let's let's do this, and it's gonna be the sound the sound of Terry Vice, and then I was like, okay, and it's like we are a pop American band with a little Latin like flavor, and mm -hmm. then we're kind of like put in there, it's just like a little like other the whole thing just like, has a lot of effects on it. So most of this is just following basically the uh, chord progression that's fitting on what we're doing here. Then we started like adding a little syncopation to everything. Use my trusty old jazz bass. I've had for many, many years. He did all the drum programming himself. When we play it live, we're gonna play it with a loop, you know, and me playing over the loop. To kind of give it that fullness, you know. Yeah, but you've been able to say, you know, like uh, the one you wanted the drum, something like that. Like, can you give me yeah, an idea, no, something? That's like that. fine. Yeah. Got a little swells on the uh, the reverse there. I mean, because even the bass part has what, you know, another synth bass, like two other, three other synth bass, oh, yeah. uh, supporting a, of, a regular bass guitar to give it that pop sound. You yeah, know? it's a lot of crap in there. It's a lot. How'd you come up with that bass line? Did you come up with that, or did he you came up with it? He came up with that. Yeah, it's basically, you know. I wanted something to be uh, con consistent. Consistent. I wanted something to be consistent, like it'll be like grooving. You know, my wish was looking to be different, not to be the same thing. You know, like just kind of to put a little bit of a, a, of myself in there that it's not something that is not up there already. I Just think try. that's a big part of being a songwriter and a producer. You <laughs> I have to do yeah, something. You gotta do if something, you do everything yeah. everybody else is doing, you're exactly. basically... Exactly. Now, yeah. if, I mean, if you want to just make a track that sounds like, like modern and pop, just like can copy any song in there. It's like, okay, it's going to be a chorus, the kick's doing this. You copy all the sound and just like reproducing something. It's, it's yeah. already up there, but you, you know, the thing to be a producer is just to put a little bit of, uh, of yourself and then in there well, one of the cool things that we get to add like so many actual live instruments you know That's bass true. which kind of adds on to the uh pop makes it a little bit more unique than your yeah. average you know and we have some latin percussion as well in there and latin percussion so yeah. and it, and i like that it's not there's not too much latin percussion because we don't we're not i don't want to be identified and we're not a latin band we're a pop band that has a latin feel you know so it was important to me when I heard this song that we kept that funk, that that little, you know, that that urban, you know, soul to it, uh, but threw in a little bit of percussion instruments here and there, Latin feel, here and there, but not make it Latin. Even if you call. 